Yeah, hello guys and welcome to another video in this video i'll be teaching you how to trade the binance futures using your smartphone first and foremost you need to download the binance app on your phone register it and verify it if you don't know how to do that i've done a video on that already i'll drop the link of the video on the description of this video so do where to check it out once you've done you need to deposit money to your spot wallet i've already done a video on how to deposit money on buy now i'll be trading a uh, tron tron usd the first thing you need to do is you need to have some tron on your spot wallet or your features wallet currently i don't have any tron as you can see here i don't have any tron on my features wallet but i have some tron on my spot wallet so i'll first of all transfer some tron from my spot wallet to my features wallet and this is how you can do that click on the menu button here then this will pop up here just click got it then you scroll down click on this uh, more then click on this transfer button here and since i'm transferring from my spot wallet so my spot wallet need to be up so i'll just click this button here to interchange it that way spot wallet will be up as you can see it's already up uh, funding i'll select where i'm transferring it to which is a coin futures yeah then i'll now come down here and select strong here you can type in the amount here i can just click max all the tron you have on your spot wallet will just appear then you click on confirm transfer so once that is done let's go back to our futures uh click futures then our coin futures if you look closely you see here i have some tron currently here yeah, so this is how you can transfer from your spot wallet to your coin futures wallet so yeah, i can be able to trade futures definitely must do analysis before you either buy or sell so to view the chart you click this button on this the chart here you do your analysis if your analysis tells you to sell you sell if your analysis tells you to buy you buy once you're done with your analysis then you go back by clicking this button here so once you get here you drop down this button here this button then you select isolated forget about cross select isolated and click confirm then uh, you collect the leverage here then uh, i'll choose 3x leverage let's assume my analysis told me to sell once you, you click sell make sure sell is highlighted if you want to buy you click buy then you select limit select market execution this pop up will appear just click the cancel button right here to clear it the next thing is to impute the amount you want to risk here once you impute the amount you want to risk the next thing you do is you set your stop loss and take profit to set your top stop loss and take profit you need to select this button and click the advanced button right here so once you click the advanced button right here so this one will appear you click ok it's at this point this is where you set your take profit and this is where you set your stop loss so to set your take profit so any amount you want to take your profit you set it here then here is the percentage you want to take your profit maybe you want to take your profit once you've gotten a 10 percent of your capital or 20 percent 50 percent of your capital you just set it here then if you want to set your take profit based on the market price then you just click on the market and impute the price you wish to take your profit at so that is just it. the same thing applies to stop loss if you want to set your stop loss here is where you put the amount if you lose the equivalence of that amount the trade will automatically stop then here is see the percentage if you don't want to lose more than 20 percent of your capital you just put 20 percent here then here is the market price if you want to stop your loss based on market price when you go to the chart you look for the market price that you wish to stop your losses just in case the trade goes against you if you get to that particular price your trade will automatically stop so that's it guys that's how to set your take profit and stop losses once you're done setting that you click the confirm button right here so i'll go ahead and set mine i'm done setting mine 50 percent uh, take profit and 50 percent stop loss so i'll go back now by clicking confirm button okay then uh, if you look closely you see that under take profit and stop loss you see the figures are already there then uh, once you're done you click the sell button once you do that your trade will start running guys so that's how to trade uh, features with stop loss and take profit on the binance platform using your mobile phone so guys 
that's it for this video if this video was helpful don't forget to give it a like and also subscribe to the channel if you're new talk to you on my next video